I'm going on my first international flight and I'm doing it alone. So I thought what better time to try and crochet my first garment as well. Unfortunately, I have plain anxiety though. So I waited until I got to Switzerland to start. So that was a waste of nine freaking hours. Um, anyways, I bought this pattern. It's going to be like a sweater shrug, like those crop, super crop sweater things that you put on over like your crop tops or whatever. And you know, I don't really know how to crochet. I've crocheted some pillows before, but I had hope in this pattern that it would just teach me what to do. Anyways, I crocheted most of the flight back from Switzerland and tell me why this is like all I have done. I went through like all of Death Note during Switzerland and on the flight back. And why is this all I have done? I thought I would be done by now. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I only crocheted like half the flight home because halfway through the lights went off and I felt bad turning my light on. So I didn't do that. And just out of curiosity, I timed myself and it takes me 11 and a half minutes to do one Oh my gosh. But after crocheting through an entire season of Naruto, I am now done with one sleeve. One sleeve! How do y'all have the patience for this? This is it styled, but I don't plan to wear it with anything necessarily. I just made it because I thought it was cute, to be honest. This is what the back looks like. Again, it covers everything. This is another mini skirt of mine, and compared to the one that I did before, they're about the same size, so... Long time no see. Nach einer Stunde. Nach zwei Stunden. Nach drei Stunden. Seht ihr das? Ich bin so am Schwitzen, weil ich im Dachgeschoss lebe. Nach vier Stunden. Nach sechs Stunden Schweiß gebadet. Nach sieben Stunden. Nach neun Stunden. Rückteil ist schon dran. Nach zehn Stunden. Nach elf Stunden. Things to
so beautiful and so cool, too. There's something different about her, like she's got this special aura. So thin and such a pretty face. <gasps> ich lerne Deutsch. Is it just you? That just makes sense crochet edition first up is something i cannot crochet without and it's the shield ring to protect my finger from getting burned by the yarn in my tension hand i got mine off of etsy a few years ago but you can get yours anywhere next up is these finishing needles from susan bates they have an eye that takes up most of the needle which is perfect for those pesky little loose ends that were cut too short you can really get any length woven in with these and i promise once you try them you will never go back to another regular darning needle ever again one thing I never seem to have enough of are these quick little locking stitch markers from Clover. They're great for holding your working loop on crochet projects that are in progress between crocheting sessions. Finally, we have embroidery floss bobbins for your shorter pieces of leftover yarn. I don't know about you, but I was wrapping the butts of my skeins around everything from crochet hooks to hair clips before I started using these. Thanks for watching! Welcome back to Surprise Song O'Clock. I actually had a few really nice, fun people ask me to do this one, so I figure, like, I'm, I'm hoping it might go well. Oh? Uh, so maybe we'll start with, like... <gasps> it's fine. It's fine. 
I'm sad. I think she should mess up. Sorry. You know how they say like you can't be angry while saying the word bubbles, like it's impossible? That's how I feel about Hey Steven. You know we were talking earlier about who is Mother's Day. It is Mother's Day! Is she doing the best day? I secretly record this song for I'm Fearless. <gasps> oh my gosh! <gasps> Double Fearless! It was the sweetest thing ever because I just think she couldn't have comprehended that I would write a song about the two of us, but I had done it. I'm gonna try to play it. I don't know what's gonna happen, but I just... I'm proud of one of these. Okay, bye. But I'm